Okay guys, uh, as you can see I have the background edited on the uh, palm pre on the phone dialer. Uh, this video is going to show you how to change that and how to customize it. Alright, go ahead and have your phone, your palm pre, uh, connected to the USB on just charging. So right here, just make sure it's just charge. That's where we're going to be at. Okay, if you come up here, we're going to go ahead and get into the putty session, just like we showed in the other videos. Going to go ahead and use whatever IP address that's shown on your phone. And whenever you come across something that says the SSH, uh, that is this right here using the putty. I'm going to go ahead and open it. Are you able to zoom in? Okay. Where it says log in as. Going to go ahead and use the username and password that you set up. We already set up test. And the password is root. Remember when you type it in, it doesn't show up. I'm going to get back down to the sudo file, to the root. It's going to ask for the password. The password is root. There you go. Now we're there. Now, to be able to change anything, you have to mount and unmount. So you're going to type in mount. And make sure it's an O and not a zero. So I'm out unmounting right now. And then I'm going to remount as a rewritable. So read and write. Right there and forward slash. And now you can read and write. If you go over here to the web page, this is uh, the code that you're going to be using on how to change it. Okay, first we're going to direct to uh, the applications file with all the images. So once again, once you copy, all you have to do is right click and it'll automatically paste it. And this is bringing up the list of all the images. You can go in here and change anything that you want. No, I can always change mine. So you can change anything that you want on here. We're worried about, for the dialer, we're just worried about these three right here. So I'm going to copy. And then right click again and it will paste. Now what this did is it's copying it from that, that list onto your USB drive on your Palm Pre. Oh, sorry. This one is creating a backup for it. Then when you come down here, this is going to create it and put it onto your USB drive. Copy, then paste. So now it's on your USB drive. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and go back to the pre. We're going to press the notification area. We're going to go to the USB drive. Now it's in USB mode. We're going to open it up. And go ahead and close down the putty for now. Closing the session. Now I see here you have three PNGs. This is, that, this is the uh, background that I was using. This is for the scroll. I just have it say where it says Ghostbusters. I like Ghostbusters. And then the section line. I'm not really worried about the last two. I'm just going to show you how to do the background. You can use whatever you want. If you want to use Photoshop, use Paint, whatever uh, program that you have. So you're going to right click and just go to edit or open with. You can open it with whatever you want. So say if I have this, I'm going to go ahead and change everything black. Just as an example. Alright, let's, uh, let's go ahead and put, who are you going to call, since I'm all about the Ghostbusters. We're going to make it green, and uh, we'll use a brush. Who are you going to call? You can put whatever you want. If you have some Photoshop skills, you can do whatever you want. Uh, this is just a proof of concept, so you know how to do it. So who are you going to call? Go to file, then save. Now when you close this, when you click on it, there's our new image. Now what we need to do is get it back onto the pre. So you're going to take your pre and go ahead and disconnect it from USB. 
Now, for this tethering to work, with tethering means to hook up the computer to the uh, pre over the wireless, it has to be on. If it the screen goes off, the battery saves and it turns off. So you have to make sure that it's uh, the screen is still on. Make sure your USB or your uh, Wi-Fi is on. Get back into Putty. Put in your IP address again. Report. Okay, logging in with your same password and everything. Getting back to the root file. Okay, we already had the mounts, uh, we already had the drive mounted as a read write. So we're going to go back here. Now we have to get the three files back to their correct location. So then copy. Back to putty and paste. And there you go. Now it's on there. Now we're going to unmount the read write and put it to read only. If you do not go back to read only, anybody with an internet connection can get into your pre. So we're going to unmount it again. Make sure it's a, an O and not a zero. Remount as a read only. R O, then forward slash. Now it's read only. Now we're going to go ahead and reboot. And as soon as I press enter, I'll start rebooting. Okay, now we're back. It's rebooted. And now you'll notice I go to the phone dialer and it has changed. Who are you going to call? Hey, you can change it to whatever you want. Uh, if you have graphical experience, do your thing. Alright, thanks very much.